minus of this film is their actual, co you know, the, they're not just play costumes, this is actual clothing, this is an actual um, barn. Everything is very authentic. These are handmade blades. It's pretty insane. This is real blood. All right, that's a lie. Uh, with the blood, uh, homemade's pretty good, if you know the recipes, and so we've got a few different types for different parts of the film. We'll be doing a big scar wound on the neck when there's like a fake metal collar. Rope burns, just dirtying, dirty hair, dirty fingernails. Um, and then we're going to make some whipping scars on the back as well. And Louisa is mainly in the white with black. When she arrives at the farm she's quite muddy because she's just uh, walked a fair way so she's fallen fallen down in the mud quite a few times. And Mr Black is pretty much in all black. And he sort of needs to look very ominous, quite a looming character. Fernie Hurst was settled in about 1830 and built the sheds in about 1840, which consists of a little cottage, a stable and a barn, which now is the shearing shed. The buildings would have been built by convicts and the stone was quarried like within 300 metres of the sheds. We've got such an amazing farm place that we're working on, our location. But there's so much sheer volume of stuff to sort out, clean out, move out, bring in our own stuff, set up, you know, make things look old or grubby or that kind of stuff. When in doubt, cover it with hessian. You've got the perfect old farmhouse, then you realise you've got an electrical box or a, a telephone, which is totally inappropriate, cover it in hessian. Wrap a bit of rope around it, some chain, dangle chains, you know. A lot of it we've just managed to just pull out of nowhere with a lot of help from the tip shop. So we can whip it together with paper mache and rubber bands and it looks right, then we do that, you know, especially on a limited budget. I had to make an arm today from there to there and it's made out of uh, pig skin and actual gut and bone and blood sacs in condoms in there so that when we chop it we've got bodies in body bags and stuff one of them we're calling dead mary is fully articulated and she's got still she's been uh, sort of killed and viscerated and left We had uh, Georgia and James both doing this, a similar kind of setup, and they just had the practical lantern, which kind of was nice, warm on their face, and then a bit of moonlight around, and it just came out looking really moody. There were kind of all chains all through here, and it was, um, yeah, it was, a, it was a really nice looking setup. Lots of deep shadows and things like that, which, uh, yeah, hopefully a very horror kind of vibe. External shots are always quite tricky, I find, when you don't have a really big crew and you can't put up big, you know, diffusion sails and things. It's a bit hard fighting the sun. But we've had some really nice ones um, outside, you know, we've had some, especially with that smoke, you know, we've created some really kind of cool atmospheres. And it's been a really good crew. There's a lot of, uh, a lot of fresh faces, a lot of people who haven't worked on films before. It gives this spark to filmmaking when everyone's kind of fresh and they'll just try anything and, and it can create a really kind of, a really cool result. Thank you, crew. <laughs> I mean, how can you thank people enough like, from the bottom of my heart? It um, was uh, a life-changing experience. And I'm just so encouraged now to try and make more films and try and you know, get paid work for these people who donated their time to this production. And, and hopefully it's the beginning of a Tasmanian filmmaking ensemble that will go on to make many more films together. I'm Tallulah and I'm the Lamb Wrangler and this is Rachel the Lamb. My name's Sally Thompson and I'm Standby Props and Art Department Assistant. Hello, my name's Richard Williams and I'm operating second camera on Little Lamb. My name's James Grimm and I play Mr Black. Hi, I'm Caitlin and I'm the Sound Assistant. Erica Green, stills photographer. Hi, I'm Remo, uh, Glenn Dinning and I'm the Gaff. 
My name is Hugh Jones and I'm Head of Technical Movement. Hey, I'm Eva. I'm doing Prop Standby and Art Department Assistant. My name's Eddie and I am in the Art Department. Joe Collins and Wardrobe Standby. I'm Michelle Wood and I'm doing Continuity. My name's Monica and I'm doing Makeup and Costume. I'm Adam and I am Assistant Backup, whatever anyone needs me to be. My name's Charlotte, I'm doing Makeup Assistant. My name's Luvia Knight and I'm the Second Assistant Director. Hey, I'm Max Korobax and I'm the Assistant Editor and Data Wrangler. Hi, my name's Simon Whitney and I'm doing sound recording on Mireille Kim's documentary Extravaganza of Little Lamb. Hey, my name's Johnny Skulls and I'm here as the Second Stills Photographer. I'm Gushy Soda, I'm the Production Designer for Little Lamb. My name's Lyndon Skulls and I'm the Papa for the shoot. Hi, I'm Danielle Watley and I provided the horse and I'm the stunt double. My name is Narissa Davis and I am unit manager and production assistant. My name is Roger Scholes. My job on this film is as the line producer and the mental producer for the film. Hi, I'm Gerhard and I was hired to put this wall up to be burned tomorrow. I'm Lara, I'm on the art department team. I'm Karen Adams and I'm the head makeup artist. Okay, I'm Carmen Escobar Robinson and today I'm doing Makeup Assistant and in a few days time I'm going to be a featured wench called Maggie. Dale, I've uh, been part of the art department. My name's Bernard Lloyd, I'm the runner. i got to get the sticks, i got to get the wood, i got to get the smoke going. Hi, my name is Carmen Falk and I am the first AD on the shoot. Hello, my name is Mira Kim and I'm making a documentary of making of The Little Lamb. I'm Will Mooney and I'm the boom operator. I'm Toby and I'm the sound recordist. Hi, my name's Alice and I'm an art department runner and I'm also doing rope access. I'm Zach Hardacre and my role is camera assistant and pretty much anything anybody wants me to do. My name's Luke and I'm the cinematographer. My name is Georgia Lucy and I don't know what I'm doing here. Hi, I'm Nina Milliken and I'm in the art department for the Little Lamb short film. Hello, I'm Byron Smith and I'm with the art department crew. I'm Good Keurig and I'm playing Agnes. Uh, my name is Paul Lusing and I've been the cook for the cast and crew during the film shoot. I'm Richard Sparrier, I've been helping collect props and also I've been helping uh, bring the food out of the day. Hi, I'm Gino, I'm in costume with Joe. Hi, I'm Rose, I'm the third assistant director in charge of all the extras. Hi, my name's Melinda and I'm here to be a convict wench. Hi, my name is Mary McDonald and I'm going to be a convict wench too. Hi, my name is Derek Millhill. I'm here to look after the chap's gears. Hello, Kelvin Daly. I'm one of the uh, soldier guards. Hi, I'm Claire Ferry and I'm going to be an extra uh, convict wench today. My name's Ellie and I'm here to be an extra. Emily Sawite, I'm here to be an extra. My name's Lou Convoy, um, I'm here to play an extra. I'm Antoinette O'Brien and I'm here to be a wench. I'm Jess and I'm here to be a wench. I'm Thea and I'm here to be a wench. Tara Carroll my name is and I'll be a, a convict wench. I'm John and I'm the fat soldier. My name is John Presser, P R E W C R, and I'm one of the prison guards. My name's Bryony, and I'm here as an extra today playing a convict woman. I'm Deirdre Hargraves, I'm an extra. I think I'm a new arrival. I'm Elise Taylor, and I'm here as an convict wench today, an extra. Hi, I'm Alicia, and I'm one of the extras. Hi, I'm Michaela Harvey, and I'm playing a convict wench. I am Sophie Terry, and I'm playing a convict wench today. Hi, my name's Sarah Pensafini, and I'm playing a convict wench today. I'm Bryony Jeeves, and I'm playing a convict wench. My name's Heidi Lee Douglas, and I'm the writer, director, producer of Little Lamb. Yeah. Hello.